Hello. Welcome to Happy Scrappy Saturday, which is not my normal day for doing Happy Scrappy Lives. But this week was, oh, first week back to school. So Happy Scrappy Thursday didn't happen because of a migraine. And Happy Scrappy Friday didn't happen because I was out having dinner at a German restaurant. And it was really delicious. So welcome to those of you coming in. Say hi in the chat. Let me know that you're here. Who's here? today. Hi, Angela. I am going to scrapbook two photos of my daughter and husband at Spaceship Earth, I think is where we were in Epcot. Um, but before I did that, I wanted to show you what I do for my Disney. So I have, I've got, I've been to Disney three times. I have only printed off pictures for one of the trips, like a whole batch printed off. These are all of the pictures that I have that I still need to scrapbook. Hey, Laura. And I have them all on page protectors because at one point I had had them in my Disney albums. And my goal this year is to actually get these on the layouts. And if I'm not going to get it on the layout, then just get it into the right size divided page protector. Get it in the album on the correct day and move on because I want to be done with this. This is from 2017. My, my birthday, hey, Mora, was in 2018. And I really want to print those photos. And then we went back last year for a quick trip. And... I want to get those done too. That was involved Universal and Disney. So there's so much I still have left to do and I want to get it done. And so that's my goal. So this is what I've got. And I show you that because that make then makes why this looks like this makes sense. So I put things together in groups in the page protectors. And when I had didn't have enough photos, I put these little um, cards in there. So this page I completely finished. This page, I just have these two photos on, which is one reason why I picked to do this, because then I will actually be done with this page. And I can put these Project Life cards back into my stash and actually put that page protector in my page protector album. So I'm excited about that. All right, so today I am using Chamel's collection, which is my favorite collection from her. I picked it because, of, so these are in my vertical paper holders that are sitting on the floor right by my desk and pulling it in and out has bent this one. And so I want to use that paper so I actually can get it out of there and it won't get bent up anymore. Um, Starshine, like I said, was my favorite collection. I tended to buy paper pads at that point. I did not realize the quality difference in the paper pads versus the individual sheets. But you can see if you can see it here. Hey, Miranda, but they are two different shades of blue. Like the colors are more intense on the individual sheets, which is why I don't buy paper pads anymore. And you also don't get all of the paper. So I picked up some 12 by 12 individual sheets of patterns that weren't in here. And then I actually bought these at Tuesday morning the 25 packs of the same sheet. Hi, Sherry. Hey, there, hey, I am not talking to you, Siri. You stop talking back. Goodness gracious, Siri is a nosy little thing. Um, I bought these at Tuesday morning and I don't tend to buy the 25 packs all of the same, but this one I love to cut apart. I love to die cut and can't get enough of it. And this one, both sides are basic enough that I can mix them in with other collections. So that's why I bought those. So I'm constantly using these papers and I don't mind cutting it up and screwing it up for those. And I got a ton and a half of off cuts. So let me go ahead and trim off the branding strip. I still have not counted my 2019 branding strips, which means all of my 2020 branding strips are like being set aside and starting to stack up. And I'm like, ah, I don't know what that is, Miranda. I'm assuming it's Batman related. Let's see what I have in here. Cut apart. Oh, hold on. I want to grab my six this bag too. There we go. All right. Oh, I have this, which I've already even inked. And I never pulled ink out. Nor Nouveau Drops. Wow, I am like off my game today. I reorganized my Nouveau drops yet again. 
because I got some new ones in my tonic craft kit and wanted to swatch them and get them on my Nouveau shelf. Let's go ahead and put these upside down. I chose dandelion yellow, calming aqua, and what's this one called? Midnight blue. So those are my favorites for the most part. And they match everything. Okay, are y'all just really quiet or <laughs> or we're just not talking? Or you know, people have left. So I like that. I like that. I think I might use this brilliant as my journaling box. So let's pick that up so I don't roll over it on the chair. So today has been kind of a lazy day. Had a headache earlier, took a nap, that helped. And <laughs> it's interesting how we can feel sorry for essentially the villains looking at their background, isn't it? But I started, I did swatches of like the new drops and stuff that I picked up. And then I was like, you know, I'm going to be going to an actual, real, honest goodness scrapbook store this week. And I have no idea if they're going to have Nouveau products there, but if they do, I may pick some up. And I don't have everything swatched. So I ended up swatching all of my glitter paste, the glacier paste that I haven't done yet. I swatched my stuff from Bow Bunny that I purchased many moons ago. Miranda, you were at my house then, and that was when Dolly was with us too. We went to Tuesday morning. Um, so I have spent the afternoon and evening swatching up a storm. Oh, you did a stash bass palooza. That's where everybody was. Six, and that is impressive, Laura. I don't know if you can tell. Um, my voice is a bit rough, so I'm drinking my tea. Hopefully that will help. Be glad of life because it gives you the chance to love and to work and play and to look up at the stars. I like that. We're going to use that um, I don't know why I have that I don't know why I have that those are offcuts I don't need trash anything here I don't think so Ooh, this might be good to pull in some of those we'll use that this would pull in some of the color altogether. Now we're getting somewhere. And look, here's this strip. I've used one of those silly tags. <laughs> but nope, that's okay. I have this. I just have to use that little bit and then I could cut the branding strip off and keep it. And save it. Oh, I've got this bit of orange. I like that too. What are these? You and me. Well, you know what, this map right here, because what they're doing is they're trying to bring energy to different businesses, I think what is what it was doing, what was going on. So that would be, a map would be a thing to include. And the colors match since it's all in the same color. What about this hot air balloon? We'll put that in so that way we've got something in all those little pinks. And I've got this strip. I don't really feel like that strip. And I'm pretty sure as much as I love Chamel, I don't think I need to keep that teeny tiny piece. All right, let's back some paper. I think we'll do this. 
So six by eight. So six and a quarter by eight and a quarter would work. All right. <laughs> Are you raising your hand, Sheree? <laughs> You're so funny. I love it. This feels like the wrong size for some reason. I don't know why. Sheree, um, the Secret Not Secret Kit Club is a ton of fun because you get a customized kit sent to you based on your favorite things. Or for me, Christina likes to make up Kits. I, I do a challenge for We have an online scrapbooking party every month with the club. And one of the challenges I do involves a color palette. So I have her make me a kit for my color palette every month. Um, Miranda, I am doing two photos with Matthew and Elizabeth um, at Epcot. I think we were in Spaceship Earth. I think. I can't remember. This is why I need to be done scrapbooking this event. So, oh, you're saying hi. Oh, it looks like you're raising your hand. <laughs> I'm a teacher. Raising your hand is what I see when people do stuff. All right. I need a title. I had thought of one and now I have forgotten. Trim the tops off of this. Hi, Jennifer. Welcome. All right, so I spend my Saturday or Sunday every week setting up my planner for the following week, and I have been waiting so long to set up my planner for this particular week because I leave for creativation. So... I am going to get to go and see all of the new collections in person and talk to the people who are creating them, which is going to be like super fun. Let's trim. Oh, I've got another edge I could trim off too. Um, let me trim this edge. Trim off the writing strip. There we go. I think I want to use this side of it. Okay, you'll be back. You cleaned your scrappy desk. Uh-oh, put your mojo away. I've had that happen, Jennifer. When I have that happen, I have found that... That's not going to work for this. I have found that just playing with supplies and not really, like, making a layout, but, like, getting my stamps out and just stamping things. Going, hmm, how does this look together? How does this look? That with my scrappy mojo. I really like this washi tape, but I wish when it was cut out, it was cut out more to where it actually like went along with the flowers because it feels like abnormally large, which is why I think I struggle with using it. Oh, let's see, what else could I possibly put in there? This could work. It's going to bring in some purple, though. I really don't have. Oh, but you know what? The purple over the yellow doesn't really look much like purple. <sighs> there we go. We'll try that. That's from Head in the Clouds. And we're just going to trim a bit off the end here. that away so I don't knock the drawer over. So what kind of things do you guys want me to look for at Creativation? Because I can do videos. I am planning on bringing my iPad, which means I'll be able to edit while I'm there to upload things to YouTube. I'll be doing lives. I don't know if I'll do lives here or on my Facebook group. I haven't quite decided that part yet. 
Let's see, I want this. I think I want it underneath it. Um, I am using Chamel's collection Starshine, which is an older one. It's from 2015. But it is hands down my favorite Chamel collection. Which with as much as I like Chamel, you know, that's that's impressive that I can actually have a favorite. <laughs> Here, there we go. All right, I like that. And then we're gonna put this here, and I think we're gonna put it on foam tape, which, of course, I have up with my Christmas stuff. <sighs> so, of course, I know. Obviously, I'm going to be seeing and showing Chamel's new stuff for sure. Miranda has, it's not box of crayons. It is starshine. See? Starshine. Silly woman. See, I like field trip a lot. I'm going to be visiting and showing Paige Evans stuff per Miranda's, um, request. Hmm, I could do a title of light it up because that's what they were trying to do is they're trying to light up the cities or something. Elizabeth. Elizabeth. She just came upstairs. I don't know where she is. I was going to ask her if she remembered what we were doing in this. Ah, I hate when that happens. Oh, box of crayons is my favorite. I like Box of Crayons, but Starshine is my favorite. I love this one because it's got tons of stars and stuff. And that is like where my heart is. We're going to put that there. We're going to put this one here. And that one will likely, I put my title up here. And I could trim. So this is a branding strip that had ripped in half. And even when they're in the pads, I still take them out and trim them. But when it rips, I'm like, eh, whatever. World won't end. I wish I had purchased more of her Christmas magic. That has been my favorite Christmas collection ever to work with. And I'm sad that all I have are tiny little scraps left. Okay, I need a title. What should my title be? I can't come up with one. <laughs> yeah, Miranda, I know you don't like those big primary colors. What do you think of her new collection? What's it called? I just forgot what it was called. Um, I don't know. What is it? Fly, something with flying, because the title reminds me of Peter Pan. Yeah, I'm sad you're not feeling the new collection, too. Hey, Miranda, be my assistant. Start making a list for me. Chamel, Paige Evans, Vicki Booten. Obviously, I'll be doing Nouveau, too. I mean, you know, because hello, it's me. Um, hmm. Well, I will try to come up with some incredible photos of the new Chamel collection, whatever it's called, because clearly I'm not remembering. Somebody needs to look that up. It's driving me crazy now. And that it is like the best collection ever and you will be in love. No, don't get into more vintage, but <laughs> Maggie Holmes, Crate Paper, Simple Stories. Oh, I can't wait to see some of the Simple story stuff in person. Are they the ones that just did the magical birthday? Like that? Excuse me, I was looking at that on a cherry on top today for their pre-orders. And I'm like, oh, it's unicorns. Dear Lizzie. Okay, I can check that out. Vicky's, I looked at that one today too. And I'm sad because it doesn't make my heart go pitter-patter. Paige, Pink Paisley, other than Paige Evans. Okay, we can do that. For sure. Oh. Let me 
you one of those hard ones to line up. You know what? I'm going to actually cut this better than that. Oh, it sounds like Tucker might be getting in trouble. He's not listening to Daddy. You got to listen. Okay. All right. Miranda, are you writing all these things down for me? Since you're my favorite assistant. We're going to put this right here. Yep, that's straight. Oh, okay, I don't care about that. All right, and this one's going to go up on larger pieces of foam. Never. Thank you, Jennifer. Oh, yes. That's why it makes me think of Peter Pan. This needs something else behind it. I did not buy die cuts with this collection. I was like, what in the world was I thinking? Oh, thank you, Miranda. All right, here we go. Oh, well, I'm still going to need these. Why am I putting them away? <laughs> like, hello there. All right, I wanted to pull in some of this orange, and I think I might have. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that a lot. I think I might not be using that. It's going to go up here. That's going to go there. But you know what would work is this kind of paper. Because then I can pull in a whole lot of smaller bits of pattern and not worry about it. All right, so I need to make sure I get my journaling square down. So I finally finished watching all of the set, plan, and crush your set, plan, and crush scrappy goals 2020 edition. And because let me tell you, school started this week and it was like, um, I can't think of anything else now. <laughs> so, been enjoying watching that, and it's interesting answers that people give. And I was going somewhere with this, and I don't know where I was going now. Um, oh, shoot. What was I saying? I don't remember. Oh, this is how I know I'm getting old. I can't remember anything anymore. Now let's put the adhesive on first and then cut it. It makes my life easier. Okay, all right, and let's figure out a title. I am thinking, so I pulled out these. These are from Box of Crayons. And I was thinking about a Fitzgerald font, but I'm not sure if that's gonna work. I do have this though, and that is definitely too green. I have not opened. Oh, no, I've opened this one. Apparently to pull out sevens. I know what I did. This is my llama layout. Here we go. Here's the half. She tied Peter Pan's shoes for him. Oh, my gosh. That's so cute. Didn't... um. Echo Park have a Never collection recently because I thought I remember picking up the, I have words. I can do this. I can word today. Picking up something. Stencil. I picked up the stencil for it. Hold on. And I still have that packaging. Yeah. <laughs> Dumbest movie in the Batman franchise you've ever watched. Lost in Neverland. 
Have you seen that? I don't know if it if it's still out or not. Um, it's from 2019, so it might still be available. <sighs> what do I want? So I have this has the word play in it. So I was thinking I could do laugh and play. That might work. L A U G H. And there's an ampersand. All right, that's going to be my title, Laugh and Play. And we're going to attempt to make this look like one long piece. Just need to know. All right, right here. Oh, that's actually, is that the right one? Yep, that's the right one. And it's really long. We're not going to trim it yet, though. Stop and play. Where did, okay, here it is. Let's pull play out. I will keep my eyes open for stuff. So I know Shamel said that it wasn't intended to be like a Disney Peter Pan collection, but I know that's certainly the vibe I got from it. Oh, I'm going to turn this V into an A. How? I don't know. Maybe with this, this hashtag pound sign thing that I haven't used yet. Snip that. And if that doesn't work, I agree with you. Um, Jennifer, they do feel like they've got like a ton of stuff comparatively with other companies. But um, I don't know. It's a good question. Let's see here. We're going to be wild and crazy and cut it like this. And attempt to jam it in here. If you ever in any doubt, does this glitter ever come off the backing? The answer is yes, it will, but only when you scrape it. So that actually that looks good. Is L A U G H? That's how you spell laugh. Goofy phone number will let you listen. Oh my gosh. That's why you need an iPhone. Get rid of those Android ones. <laughs> come on, Miranda, come to the dark side. G comes next, not the H. Okay, the word play, how long is that? There was a paper ampersand. Question I have is could I trim this and lay the H for laugh and the P for play on it so that you can still see, hi Harmony, that it is an ampersand, but then I can get it all to fit on one line. Let's find out. Oh, let's ink too. There we go. Let's see here. I feel like I need to move stuff just slightly, which is going to be annoying with the A not being an A, but a V. Let's try it, though. Not that close. 
be a smidge of space between the letters. Does that look straight? Yes. All right, come on now. I need you to be slightly more cooperative. Pick that up. Oh, let's do that. Let's pick up one leg of the A, then set the middle squishy piece in, and then put the other leg down. So now we move it up too high. This is why I shouldn't do live video. <laughs> There we go. Chanel brings me great day as well. Susan, I would accept my photo is up on foam. And play will fit. I just wanted it to give just a little tiny bit more space for the ampersand. Because it will overlap and I am a-okay with that. All right, we're gonna have to turn this sucker sideways though so I can get it all down right. All right, put this here, knock away all the paper that I have currently sitting out. Ink the edge. Now, let's get play to fit. And it will fit. I will make sure of that. <laughs> I'm a resourceful third grade teacher. I will make it work. Laugh and play, except the P is slanting in the wrong direction. And that's going to drive me crazy because that is not how you do your cursive piece. And I just broke my nail. Fabulous. Let's see here. I cannot go like that. Can't go like that. We'll have to go like that. Increase the slant. There we go. Let me see how that looks. Oh, I fight with letters on a regular basis, Harmony. That is like a guarantee for almost every single layout I will ever do in my entire life. Laugh and play, you and me. I like that. That will work. Let's see, this is going up here. Let's go ahead and glue that piece down. So we can work on getting some more stickers in there. All right. So what else do you guys want to see from Creativation now that we are making Miranda take notes for us? Or me, actually, because she is amazing. And if I ever come to her house, I can only imagine what she would torture me with. That is like really crooked. And so was that. Okay, I think that works. Alrighty. That's going to go there. You and me is going to go here, but I want some something in the background to go along the, vertically or horizontally, whatever this direction is. I could do some of the orange and just trim it. Uh, I don't feel that, though. Let's see. Could do this. I like that one. Oh, absolutely. Um, I told Christina that if she loses me, she can find me either at the American Crafts booth or in the Nouveau booth. Well, Tonic Studios, but, you know, Nouveau. And then I looked up on the map. They are at completely opposite ends of Creative Vision. You know what? I am okay with that. I will be getting my steps in. Ooh, Bella Boulevard. I am excited, too. I am super excited about that one. Okay, this tiny print is making my eyes go all wonky. I'm also curious to see um, Doodlebug. Because I want to see more of like completed projects in person. So that maybe it will give me some more inspiration on how I could use 
Can we see my open there? Like I lost my whatever these are. What are these? Something. I don't know. Foam squares. They are foam squares. Yes, they are. Miranda, do you like Bella Boulevard? I can't remember if you do or not. Yeah, just torture me pieces ever. Please, yes. <laughs> Shamel Bella Boulevard and Doodlebug. Well, I can definitely make sure I visit those places. That is not going to be a problem. All right, I need something to go right here. Let me take a quick sip of tea. I don't have any of the green in there yet. Oh, you know what? Let's also, here we go. I also have these embellishments. So while I never bought die cuts, I did buy these, which drive me crazy since they're on clear. I kind of like this bright idea since the whole thing was about power. I guess I need to go get a piece of white cardstock, don't I? Hold on, I'll be right back. Crate paper, okay. Crystal, hello, hello. We're talking about creativation and new visit. What are you excited about seeing? I am going to fussy cut. Oh, what about pink fresh, guys? Pebbles, lovely moments. We'll write it down, girl. I'm excited to see. The new stuff Tim Holtz comes out with. I have not been watching any of his videos yet because the stuff he's put up, like he put up, he put up one of his, the companies that he works for. That's not one of my like favorite ones. So it's like, eh, I don't care about that, but I want to see what else he comes up with. I see you guys are talking, but I can't look at the screen while I am trimming. There we go. All right. Oh, meeting Maggie Holtz. To. Oh, hold on one second. All right, so what else do I want to add in here? Capture the moment would work, so would I can. None of those really work. This one I think might go down here because that seems like it would match nicely with the map. Wait, Crystal, Tim Holtz lives in your town. Is that who we're talking about? Really? I am coming to your house. All right, I need another. I don't want to do orange. I already have, but I could. That's like orange and not like coral orange. That actually might work. I'm gonna take that back. Let's try it. Oh, that's awesome. I am disappointed that he is not teaching a class of sport because I would have jumped all over that class. I'm taking um, the class by Simon Hurley, though. I'm excited about that. Especially, did you guys see his either Facebook video or YouTube video of his new products? He has finally has like an actual like royal purple that's beautiful. Because the other one he had was more of like a berry purple. It had a lot of red tones in it. Oh, Miranda, I wish I had taken classes by them. More people I wish that were offering classes while we were there. I think simple stories will be a fun um, set of papers to see. So we're putting our polka dots by our polka dots, but they are in sizes, so I'm okay with that. Where did the foam dots go again? I'm constantly losing these things. You know what? Let's do this. Let's snip some of this off. 
and use that. as our backing. There we go. I'm gonna kind of overlap the photo, overlap the photo. This is gonna have my lower foam tape on it. Crystal, what day are you getting to Creativation? Are you gonna be there on Thursday? Cause I'm excited I get to meet you. But then you have to deal with my nuttiness in person, so I don't know. <laughs> okay, and Bright Ideas is going to look like that. Okay, now I'm feeling good about how some of this is looking. Let's start getting some things down, and then we'll put in some more layers. More. My gosh, I need my voice back. <laughs> um, I said so for rediscover your stash i'm doing the spending freeze there and we get two cheats this month and i am going to be cheating in arizona like the entire trip to arizona is one big cheat for me more that's right harmony i would love to, i still keep looking at miranda's comment as you've taken classes by Paige evans and chamel love to take a class with them i'm so disappointed i get can't go to the um Scrapbook and Cards Today thing that's in May. Oh, I would end up missing our last show of the musical, which let me tell you, the director is already not happy <laughs> that I'm going to miss two rehearsals by being in Arizona. I'm like, yeah, I kind of can't miss any more than that. I just want to see what else I have on here. I really, really, really wish that I had picked up like more with this collection. More. You only fail when you stop trying. I need that on a t-shirt to wear to school. Everything starts with a dream. I like that. That's going on there. You're not going to be there till Friday? Oh, it's a long time to wait. I... <laughs> I have to say that is actually one thing I'm looking forward to so very much is hanging out with everybody. And a hotel is really close to, you know what? Actually, that's going to go down there. I'm going to do a little embellishment cluster at the bottom where I got to put the date. Probably means I should not have put the adhesive one yet. Okay, so we're just going to stick that there. Uh, let's work on that embellishment cluster. What are some things I could toss in? That I have used already. I want some of this. I could do some cameras, but I'm not super feeling that. I could do more of the washi tape, though. I totally understand, Harmony. That is how I have felt. So, going back to the musical, that's like really close to have that washi next to that washi, so I don't think so. Going back to the musical, my daughter has always come with me to rehearsals and she is in the, which means she does not come. That might work down there. She only comes right now to the Thursday rehearsals. So I am technically missing my daughter's very first musical rehearsal. And I'm like, and again, the director is like, how can you miss your daughter's first? I'm like, you understand? I have had a dream to go to this event since before she was born and I have the chance. I have to take it. He's like, okay, yeah, I guess so. I'm like, yes, I guess so. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. Yeah, I like that better thinner. We'll have to put the other piece of it somewhere. Put that right there. This is going to go up on foam. Maybe, oh, that's perfect, perfect. Oh, good. Yes, the best people are all insane. That is why we are so much fun. At least that's what I keep telling myself. 
my students are in 3C and I always tell them C stands for crazy. And the parents laugh at that at the beginning of the year. And I think then by about like October, they go, wow, she actually wasn't kidding about that craziness. I'm like, nope. But y'all laughed and didn't believe me. I'm a bit of a nutter in all of the best ways. Normal is lame. It is boring. Exactly. I always tell my students, weird is a compliment. It means that you are special and unique and not following the crowd like everyone else. And when they start thinking about it like that, they're like, yeah, that's true, actually. I'm like, own your weirdness. Be proud of it. I can't cut with that. That's going to drive me crazy. A little bit more. One more right there. There we go. So I'm weird and I'm okay with that. 110% okay. I'll <laughs> run for your adhesive. <laughs> uh, I have the best friends. Can I just say that? You guys make me so happy. Oh, I forgot I was going to put in there. I kind of cut myself out of that, didn't I? Oops. Let's see if I can peel that up. Okay. I did shockingly manage to get that up. Okay. I'm just going to take all of that off, obviously. All right. Now let's put the journaling card in. And knock embellishments to the floor. Great. Now I have Tucker hair and my hair on the adhesive. Fabulous minds. You are brilliant. Can I just say that? Ooh, I got 13 people in here. This scrappy community is awesome. You know, I, I got to say, I am quite happy with the people that I have gotten to know recently. In the past couple years, it has been amazing. And I could not have asked for a better group. And I'm so glad you guys are crazy enough to come in here and spend your evening once a week with me. And some of you even come back on Sundays on Facebook. All right. Does this look okay? Or is that too much like Coralie Peach? I'm like, not sure now. I still have to figure out where I'm going to put this now. Oh, right there works. I like that. Could somehow figure out how to use that, but I don't feel that. <laughs> Harmon, you are hilarious. I haven't yet, but I can't wait to be with you two. We should go on an adventure. Brilliant. Kind of like admit one, but there are two of them. So it's really not going to work. And I don't think I want to bring in flowers. I have this. I've only taken one or two out of. Still don't want to go with flowers. Hmm. Kind of low on the embellishment. <laughs> yeah, Miranda, that is true. Miranda's her own special brand of crazy. You know what? It really helps when you're going to stamp the date to stamp the date before you put the um, big embellishment on. I'm just going to put that out there. Okay. Um, where's? I think it was the 31st, but I got to find the page protector. Where did I put the page protector? There it is. July 31st. Okay. Oh, good. Apparently the last layout I did was also from the same trip. Put that there. July 31st, 2017. Down. Put this back. Oh, not like that though. There we go. I like that. It needs something peachy colored down there though. Well, 
template about like I like this, but it's a little big. What do I have in the six by six pad, which is over here? Bring it. <laughs> As my daughter would say. Oh, what do I have on here? Nope, I don't like any of that. What do I have on here? None of those numbers make sense. I could do something from that cut apart sheet though. Nope, not feeling any of that either. Okay, let's pull this back out and see what I have. I will be taking tons of pictures. You have no worries there. I kind of like this one. Wish I had something else with that home pattern on it. I really like that. I could bring in, you know what, here we go. Let's do this one. There will be lives for sure. I have a feeling one of us will be live and the other one will be filming other stuff so we can do actual like real videos. Uh, I agree with you, Harmony. I wish there were more papers like this. I love things like this because then like doing layers is ridiculously easy. How many times am I going to peel this up? I'm just curious. We're going to trim down to here. And yep, tuck it just like that. Perfect. And that is exactly what I want. And of course, now I can't get it to go back in. All right, hold on. Yeah. A little bit more, a little bit more. Okay. Not quite that crooked though. There we go. Hey, Tarina. 11.57 more times. <laughs> oh, that is likely the truth. Hold on. I have to stand up for a moment. I took a shower before I started this because I knew I'd be tired when it was over on it. Dang, there's another Tucker hair. Um, <laughs> but I washed my hair and now the towel is falling out of my hair and I have to fix that. <laughs> okay, that's better. All right. I need some stuff up here. I gotta, I just, oh, it's just not working for me. Just alone like that. Let me see what other embellishments I have. Let me take this with me so I know what colors I'm on with. Y'all talk amongst yourselves. Entertain each other. I don't want that. I don't want that. None of those work. Nope, nope. Like everything is girly I'm coming across. That girly's bad, I just really don't wanna go with this layout. Stars maybe, not that color though. What's this? How does that tiny little bag get in the wrong spot? Not going to move it now though. Yeah, these work, ooh. All right, Let's see if some of those colors might work. One of those work. I need to go back in time and tell myself, buy the dang die cut packs. You will regret it if you don't. I have a whole Dear Lizzie set, sticker set that I have never used, but I've opened. How weird. All right. Let's see what we have in long pond kits. 
Uh, got quark. That would work. The rat won't. This might work. Nope. Okay, I'm not more prepared, y'all. <laughs> um, Miranda, just tell Crystal I need sleep, okay? I get very cranky. I'm scrolling back through. Harmony, I'm a fan of making up words as well. It is almost nine. Oh, it is almost nine. I need to go. Well, I mean, bazillion is my favorite number. Oh, Crystal, remind me. Send me a text on Monday to bring my teapot home. Okay. Um, I have a collapsible silicone teapot that I can plug in. And um, then I can make tea. And I apologize in advance because if I don't get sleep, I really do become very cranky. Very, very cranky. I don't feel like a bow is going to be what this, color, this layout needs. Not black. Those work. Yeah. <laughs> well, at some point, I will just sleep. It's just like, oh, sorry, I'm done. <laughs> and I will just conk out standing up. All right. Last place to look. That love work. I'm not feeling it. Yeah, I get, I, I speak freely when I'm tired. Sometimes a little too freely. Again, I apologize in advance. <laughs> oh. Kind of work. Let's pull this one out. It's a giant container I really need to look into paring down. No, no. And those are all empty. Okay. <laughs> well, hopefully, everybody in that hotel room, when they keep me up at night, will still like me the next morning. All right. I'm liking these. These are funky hexagons, though. Yeah, you're gonna get the bear cat. I mean, I, 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 I'm sorry in advance. <laughs> I want this to work. Dang it! I'm not feeling it all of a sudden. Like it needs to work in here, and ooh, it works like that. Excellent. Okay, ink away. Um, Harmony, I don't have a hard time sleeping in an unfamiliar place when I'm tired. It is just like, that's it. I put my headphones in, turn on a YouTube video, and I am asleep in five minutes. That is, that says 2017, y'all. That means I got this in 2016 because this was their January kit. And it's rubber. Why am I even keeping this? I don't like rubber. Today is a beautiful day. You make my life magical. Record your memories with love. I like that. Oh, sorry. Did not mean to do that. All right. I have to make this so it works. There we go. Nope, I don't like that. My scoochie town. Scoochie, scoochie. There we go. I like that. Alrighty, would this work in here? The answer is no, but I really, really want it to. Could I? Hmm. 
Uh, move this out and make it work. There are times I swear I could fall asleep in my school cafeteria. School cafeteria is the noisiest place on the planet. I could fall asleep sitting here at the lunch table talking to third graders because I'm tired. Um, this I still want to put somewhere like I like that piece. Can I make this work somehow? I'm okay with this just like that. A little smidge of color. What do you guys think of those hexagons? Are we liking them? Okay, see, I'm not alone. I like that. All right. Oh, look, I got a patch. I could put the jacket. Got new denim jackets, and I have a place to wear my enamel pins. I'm so excited. I told Matt, I'm like, we need to get a place that will make enamel pins of Tucker. And then I could have enamel pin merch. Oh, good. You guys like the hexagons. Okay. Ooh, what does this say? Adventure and explore. I don't think those are going to work. These are a bit too bright. I like those, but no. Okay. Oh, look at this nice washi that I have never used. It matches my case. That's pretty cool. All right, y'all. I think we are in Nouveau Drop Territory. It is 9.03, and I got to go to bed soon because I've got to sing for choir a mass tomorrow, and hopefully I will have another a better voice by then. I am starting to wonder if I don't want to use yellow. Hold on one second. I wonder if that neon coral would work. I just redid this again. You know what? I think this would work. So we're going to switch out yellow with this one. And by switch out, I mean, let me carry it over there because I'm not actually going to put it away. I think we'll try that and I think some Caribbean ocean. And then I could include the yellow and just do five colors. Yay, Jennifer, I'm so happy to hear that. It's always good when the mojo returns. I had a six month stint where it just, I could not create and it drove me bonkers. Like every time I'd walk into my scrapbook room, it was like, nope. And then I'd walk right back out. These have to be in color order or that drives me crazy. All right. Let's start with blue. All righty. One. Two. Three. Four. And this will be my spot for double dot for blue. Excellent. Done with that. Bye, Sheree. All righty. One. Do that double there. Two. Three. Four. And five. <laughs> um, Crystal, I'm not bringing anything. With as many people that we have in, uh, ah, hold on, my calming aqua is clogged. With as many people as we have in our room, there's not really going to be a good place. I don't know if y'all guys, you guys can see that. That was dried in the tip. Sticking a pin through it, pop the top off because they come off easily. Stick a pin in and then wipe it off because it will be stuck to the tip of the pin. And then you've unclogged your new drops. I don't know why that happens. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. And to me, there's no rhyme or reason. I'm sure there is. You only own three. 
I, 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 I don't even know what to say to that. I reorganized my Nouveau drops. And I think with how I have them set up, I can get three more round bottles, like this kind. And then I am officially out. One, two, ah! Okay, why are we now just dotting things? Really? You gonna settle or? Okay, that works. One, two, three. Four. I just realized I could have pulled orange. Five. Oh, that goes back in this one. You've only used one once. Okay, clearly I have to bring Nouveau drops just so I can get you to use them. What is stopping you from using your Nouveau crystal? And there's got to be a reason why you're not using it yet. One, two, three, four, and five. <laughs> See, Harmony, I would disagree with that. I'm not an orange person. Like, it's just a color that doesn't look good on me, so it's a color I never really got into. But I love to scrub. Wow, this is really bright. This is the one I need to do the double drops with. Three. And right here, five. Alrighty. Yay, Brenda, I'm glad to see that. See, Crystal, that was my thought process for the longest time. And then I actually started using them more often. And it was like magic to me because I was like, oh my gosh, I could do whatever size dot I wanted and do whatever colors you want. This, so let me show you the new ones really that came out. I got my Nouveau Craft Kit in the mail yesterday and they have a new vintage drop called Blush. They have a glitter drop in sp called Spring Frost, which is really pretty because it's got like, it's got like the green glitter in it, but it also has some iridescent and some blue. And then this one is the one I am most excited about, Velvet Sage. It is a gloss drop. It, um, in the bottle, it looks a lot like Calming Aqua. They dry very differently. So I was excited. I will be happy to give you a personal tutorial, Crystal. Absolutely. 100%. Bring your, tell you what, Crystal, bring your Nouveau drops and we will play with them. Um, the reason I'm not planning on bringing mine is because when I do a layout, I have to then set it aside to let it dry. And I'm not sure space-wise if we'll have that. Um, the best red right now that they have is called Redberry. This is like fluorescent, practically. It's called Blushing Red. It is like a fluorescent coral almost, which like works with this, but it's not like red red. Um, and the red berry is a cooler toned red. So it leans more towards pink versus like a tomato red. But I want them to come out with just red. Like here's a Crayola crayon red. I also want them Crayola crayon green. Like I don't need fancy stuff. I just, you know, that's, I need a basic. Cause some of these, I'm like, I like putting stuff in, but it's like Christmas. Like I want a nice, just. Fred for Christmas. Alrighty, guys, I could talk about Nuvo all day. Um, we all know that. <laughs> so, Nuvo obviously will be a place, a booth that I will do a lot of filming for. So, next Thursday, I will not be doing a Happy Scrappy Thursday. Um, 
nor happy scrappy Friday, nor happy scrappy, happy scrappy Saturday. <laughs> um, Brenda, yes, I'm definitely suggesting those colors um, because next Thursday I will be at Creativation. So um, join my Facebook group. There will be, I'll be putting, oh, I never, I pulled these down and then never used them, which I'm okay with that. I, I like how this looks actually with the, um, the hexagons in there. Um, what was I going to say? I will also be live at Creativation, or I will be doing some live video. I'll be doing some edited video. I'll be doing some video, obviously, for the Kit Club, since that's who I'm going with. But Christina said I could also film some stuff for our group. So join me in the Facebook group. Um, it's Well Mommy Scrapping. There's a link on any of my videos to the group. Um, and you have a couple questions you have to answer to make sure you know you're an actual scrapbooker and not some spammy person. But I think you guys can handle that. Uh, I'm going to start a creation over there. So tell me the companies that want me. Is it something to care that you want to see? I can put it on the list. I make no promises since I, I've never been to creation and I don't know what is in store. Or, you know, I don't really know what it all entails um, floor wise. But I will do my best to get pictures of things that you guys want to see and maybe even some video. So um, I will be live in at, over at Wall Mommy Scrapping on Sunday at 3 p.m. Eastern. And then the next time I'll be doing some lives will be from Creativation. And I can't wait. I hope you guys all have a lovely day. Bye.